Today, we are comparing Ice Cream 5 to Ice Cream 4, so let's do this! The map in Ice Cream 5 is really unique. It has various locations where you can travel, explore and solve a lot of puzzles. It has a basement where there are a lot of electrical circuits, there is also a factory, and you can also communicate with Jay secretly in a secret room. And you can even play as him in the old map. Unfortunately though, you cannot go to the museum, at least yet, but you can still visit the old places, like Rod's garage. There is a pipe which you can travel with to another location where you can access the outside interior of this map. Unfortunately, you cannot access the whole outside interior of this huge ice cream factory, but at least it gives you an outside view. Also, as you can see here, you can go through a cart where trash is transferred and you can play a mini game where you have to lead a mini rod towards its final moments. And also, as you can see here is another awesome room, very picturesque place where trash is dumped. Now, in Ask 4, there is a cage room where the kids are located and you have to rescue them. There is also the old map which I was talking about with you before. And there is also a storage facility and a museum. Oh, check this picture guys. Check that drawing, that looks awesome. Also, you can hide in bins and you can travel through the museum with a secret pipe which leads you back to the cells. Isn't that awesome, guys? I strongly believe that it depends on your personal preference which map is the best, but to my view, the Ice Cream 5 map looks better. Gameplay The gameplay of Ice Cream 5 is really cool, as you can play as two different characters. You can play either as Jake or as Mike, by going into a secret room, where you can communicate with other people. Also, the map is awesome, there are a lot of puzzles which you have to solve, which are very unique. As you can see here, there is another great puzzle, and this is the ending of the game. Now, it looks awesome, guys, the detail of this game, how it connects two different maps together, and also those minigames, like the rod that I was talking about with you later whose eye falls down, and with that eye you can block the pipe. Also, you have two different guns, the electro gun which you had in the previous game, and another one which works with batteries. Now, in Ask 4, you only have the electro gun, which is awesome though, its use is essential, so you have to make it. Also, you can travel, as you can see here, with the museum, by unlocking this door with a very, very weird way by using Rod's trophy. The developers have put a lot of work on the items to make sure that they are as unique as possible. Check this mini game out guys. You place three ice creams and it gives you a candy. That's really really original. Also you have to set a trap for that giant which is awesome and very funny. What will we do now, in, in Ice Cream 5, there are a lot of different cutscenes, and the game covers the background of Rod and his family. These are a few of the cutscenes of this game. Father! Father! Look, I've already eaten most of my food! I don't stop falling. Jay! Hey, Mike! Woo! Yeah. yeah! Let's rescue the others. Let's go. I've seen something suspicious. Near here, there's a lot of food waste. Hmm. Maybe there's kind of a giant kitchen around here. In Ice Cream 4, there are also some very great cinematic cutscenes, as this one that we're watching right now, which is the intro of the game. Also, there are a lot of scary moments in this game, and the story adds up really great 
especially the ending where you lead the giant robot rod to its end. These are a few of this game's cutscenes. Anyway, that was the video, if you want more awesome content and gameplay and scary challenges, don't forget to leave a like and subscribe to my channel right now.